Hey everybody, Norm here at Norm's Rare Guitars with the great Tim Pierce. Hey guys. Uh, one of the great studio guitar players, played on so many hits, so many great things. Um, you know, I always love talking to you because you have so many great stories about some of the artists that you played on. You've heard him a million times. You may not have realized it, but you did. Well, I've gotten to work with some of my heroes, too, just by hanging around long enough. And Glenn Campbell was one of those people I got to work with a lot in the last 10, right. 10 or 15 years. And, you know, the reason we're doing this today is we just wanted to pay a little tribute to Glenn because he was one of our heroes and one of the great guys and, you know, just a regular guy who... Uh, everybody seemed to love, but his guitar playing was fantastic. His buddy Jerry Reed was tremendous, you know, another great player. His singing was great. Um, his tunes were really good. Um, and a serious, legitimate musician. He was part of the Wrecking Crew. Right. And he, he jumped out of the Wrecking Crew and became a big star. And Wichita Lineman is one of my favorite songs of all time. I know, I got to work with him because our friend Julian Raymond produced a lot of his music over the last 10 years. Right. I got to do Ghost on the canvas in 2011. I got to do the Grammys with him in 2012. And I got to do uh, the soundtrack uh, called I'll Be Me that kind of showed his later life. That's yeah. a really important uh, documentary if you get a chance yeah. to see it. It, it was sad at the end and it's like that for a lot of these great players, you know, I mean, where, you know, they're trying to keep it together. He was able to play. Up well, that's the thing. End. He could play and sing. His family really helped him, you know, his kids and his wife. Everybody helped him play and sing all the way down the line and even even when he couldn't remember a lot of things he could remember everything he sang and everything he could play so it's pretty pretty astounding well we get a lot of comments and most of the comments are norm money you shut up and let tim play so tim can you play a little bit for yeah, us this, is, this, this was a yeah. gift from them and glenn signed it twice I think he actually loved to sign guitars, and if you didn't stop him, he would si have signed it 30 times. That's what I'm told, anyway. Yeah. <laughs> but I, I've got two Glenn Campbell signatures on this, and it's an Ovation Tornado. And the thing I love the most is this uh, Wichita Lineman thing. Which he did, I'm told, I, th I think this is accurate, with a Fender bass six with flat wounds. Basically, that's what he played it Some on. reverb. Yeah. But this is an Ovation Tornado, which is, uh, I think, early 70s, probably. You know, I just got to say, you know, we always like to say you need a great guitar to sound great. When you can play like Tim Pierce, he could play a couple toothpicks with a rubber band and make the thing sound good. <laughs> thanks. So, the great thanks. Tim Pierce, thanks for coming in. Thank and you. Glenn, we love you. You know, thanks for everything. Thanks for the music. We love your music. Take care.